after the busy days leading up to Christmas, let's enjoy this quiet week before the new year. Instead of just thinking about New Year's resolutions, let's do one simple thing. Clean out our closets. This easy step is the start of living with less, which is what minimalism is all about. Minimalism is a concept that is quietly gaining momentum. Minimalism means keeping things simple and only having what we really need. It is finding beauty and satisfaction in less. It helps us feel calm and clear about what's important in our homes, our hearts, and with our money. Think about our clothes. Wouldn't it be nice to open our closet and see only the clothes we like that fit well and show our style? Keeping just these clothes means you like what you have more than just having a lot. It means choosing clothes that last longer, not just the newest thing. And it means spending money on things that are important. This is true for life, not just clothes. When we give away clothes we do not wear, we are not just making room. We are opening up new ways to live and think. We start to think more about what we buy. We ask ourselves, do I need this? Is this going to be useful for a long time? Does this give me joy? Having just enough clothes, not too many, is part of living simply. It is about being happy with what you have, not just looking rich. We can try some fun ideas as we clean out our closets. Think about making a capsule wardrobe, which is a small set of clothes that you really like and can wear in many ways. Or try the 333 rule, where you pick 33 items to wear for the next 3 months. This helps us to get used to living with less. There's also the 54321 way, which makes choosing even simpler by breaking it down into what you really need. And what about the past 90, next 90 idea? Look at each thing and ask if you've used it in the last 90 days, or will you use it in the next 90? If not, maybe it's time to let go. Then there's this funny rule called spontaneous combustion. If something disappeared all of a sudden, ask yourself if you would go out and buy it again right away. If you would not, then maybe you don't really need it. As we sort our clothes, letting go of a shirt or dress can remind us to save money. The space we clear in our closet can show us how we can be free with our money, and a neat closet can help us think about being smarter with our money. Take care of your money like you take care of your best clothes. Put your money in good places just like you keep your clothes nicely. Treat your savings like special. Remember, living simply is not just about having a tidy closet. It's also about being smart with money. Let us make this year about living better with just what we need. Let us pick the best, not the most. And let's think carefully as we think of our futures, simple and good.